Hey, cool, peace. Ken Sparks here, lovely to see you. Welcome back to Guitars, Songs and Home Studios. Today, I'm gonna to have a look back at what was 2020 and what is gonna be 2021. So, let's have a look, cool. Okay, so at the beginning of every year, I jump on and I do a video of what's gone on the year before and what I've got planned for this year. So last year, 2020, wasn't that good, was it? So I had high hopes for 2020. Um, I had um, support slots booked in for going out gigging to try and get my music out in a live, live sense. Um, I had a new album planned and ready to go and I had writing sessions and all that type of thing ready to go. And then it all came crashing down when the pandemic hit. Um, it was weird, it was hard for everybody and we're still going through it now. But um, I found that I couldn't write, I didn't want to play the guitar. Um, there was just too much going on elsewhere in my life and having to look after other people and look after myself. I was poorly. I contracted the, um, the COVID-19 bug. Um, I, that put me out of action for probably 15, 16 days. Worst I've ever felt in my life. And I only had it light. Um, wasn't hospitalized or anything like that, but... It was the worst I'd ever felt and the poorest I'd ever been. So that put me back. I actually found that I had to rework, get fitter again so I could actually sing because I couldn't hold or couldn't project the, vol um, the air to create any volume or sustain, um, sustain singing. So that was a downer. Um, so it was all very, very not cool but in my sort of way i decided that i was gonna try and do some work and get something done um some resilience there in my character i suppose but i suppose it's a, an artist thing that you want to get something done and you want to be able to move forward forward and progress so i decided that i was going to do the two jobs that i had been promising myself that I was going to do for a long, 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 long time was to remix and remaster the, the first two albums that I put out. So that's what I was doing. I was remixing and remastering these two pieces of art, my first two albums, Unfinished Business from 2017 and Has It Got What It Takes in 2018. So I remixed them, remastered them, um, and I've produced uh, some unlimited edition of these albums on CD. They will be coming out on digital download at some point, um, but just for folks who like to get their f little mitts on physical merchandise, I'm doing a limited edition number of CDs, which is fantastic. So I managed to get something done in 2020, which is great. If you'd like to get hold of these uh, you can look, look on my Bandcamp account which is below uh, there are there are some left they're going quick um, so jump in and get them thank you so I managed to get something done I managed to get two jobs that I needed to get done but I didn't have the time or I wasn't allowing that time to go to those jobs so 2020 it was a stinker it was horrible um, but I managed to get a big project done, so I'm happy about that. With writing and with playing, when it came to the end of the year, around about November time, uh, maybe October, late October, I actually started to get my mojo back a bit. And I started to write and I started to pick up the guitar and play again. Um, I produced one song and got that out by mid, uh, early December, I think it was, that was called 21. Um, I'll put a link up here. You can go and see that video if you haven't seen it already. Um, and I started working on a set of song, a new song uh, called Haunts of Old, which is still in the demo phase, uh, but that's working and I'm, I'm moving that forward. 
but I managed to get some music written and some recording on, which was which was great. Um, Twenty one was all cat was all catalogued and the way that I wrote it and the way that I produced it and that's catalogued and you can see those videos in my Patreon crew if you want to join the crew um, again links down below help me to continue to create content and stuff for you to listen to and music but the, all those videos are there I think there's 20 I think there's about 24 videos or 23 22 videos of how I produce that and they're still coming I've still got still work going on there and producing that and putting it into the crew and Horns of Old is here on YouTube how I've demoed it, wrote it, um, and how I'm progressing that song through, and how I create a, from a demo to a final, a final fully produced song. So that's on YouTube. I'll put a link up for that as well. So that, that, that's great, uh, and it, it was really good that I was able to get those things moving for 2021. Um, my goal is to get a new album out and to play more live shows obviously live in here because we can't go out and play live again but I did l not play as many live shows as I wanted to last year obviously with being poorly and then losing that mojo but I want to get back into doing it I don't know how I'm going to do it yet whether it's just going to be the acoustic uh, and vocal again or whether I'm going to bring in um, more of a production side so it can play along with the backing tracks of all the music that I played and created for the for the albums but, uh, um, but I want to get back into that so for 2021 I want to be getting more live shows I'm just in the process of organizing uh, and planning out an album so my fourth album for 2021 um, I'm not going to say when it's going to be out, um, but it is in the gears are starting to work and we're around with that. Um, the Speechless EP that I put out in 2018, I'm remixing and remastering that, so that will be coming back out. And the aim is to, to grow as, a, as an artist. Um, hopefully more people will come along and follow me uh, and support me. Uh, either by buying CDs uh, or buying downloads or listening on YouTube or listening on Spotify, sharing the news, um, helping to pass on the fact that I, I am here and create music. Um, you can also join me and help me and support me in my Patreon, become a patron um, and get all the benefits of behind the scenes and um, exclusives and all the other things are coming in that in that group and being part of the crew which is cool so because this is called guitar songs and home studios we're going to finish off with a song this is from back in 2020 i think it was it might have been last year i did a series of as i do every year in october it was a song a day and in 2019, I did, I played all the songs live uh, and recorded them and then put them out. But in 2020, because of what was going on, I did a little bit of a mismatch of live performances, uh, videos that have been promos for songs uh, and some archive stuff. This song is a new song which is going to be on the new album for this year. It's still in the demo form. Um, but it's called Rebel Angels, uh, and I'll let you listen to it. I hope you enjoy it. How I love those rebel angels Singing of peace and harmony Singing songs of meaning 
Never hid from controversy Stood strong behind their feelings Taught the world how it could see some comments thanks for being here remember to if you like what you see hit that bell down there Ka -ding! subscribe to the channel uh, give me a thumbs up please because that will help uh, me to move the channel forward and to get other people so they can see this video um, leave some comments tell me what you think come on over to Twitter and Facebook uh, follow me there join in the conversation um, Check out my website and my Bandcamp account where you can buy CDs and download more of the songs and albums that I've got available there. Cool. Thanks for being here. You guys and girls rock. Remember, stay safe, and I'll see you again soon for another Guitars, Songs and Home Studios. See you soon. Peace.